Today's business section will look at the important advocacy work. Really what we've come out from is we've got a great foundation that we've set up. I'm really excited by what we were able to still achieve with all of the challenges that we had last year. And more importantly, uh, the FCA, so the Foreign Chamber Alliance, which is something that's been around for some time, we were able to really grow on that and partner with our other uh, chambers as well as do some great advocacy work with the Australian Embassy. Look, the, the Foreign Chamber Alliance is something that has been around for a while. It's a culmination of the Australian, American, British and German Chambers of Commerce. It's, it's an alliance, so it's not a formal entity in any way. But what we do is we look that with all of our members and it's several million employees across uh, several thousand companies that we, the four chambers represent. And what we aim to achieve is when there's similarities, when there's combined initiatives that can support all of our members, uh, the power of four voices as one is always much better than a singular voice. And uh, the power behind that actually became stronger again when it became a voice of eight and then of course a voice of 10 with another two parties joining us. So can you tell us our members more about that? Yes, yeah, so what we were able to achieve last year um, was we started to incorporate working proactively with all of our embassies. So ultimately we've got our four chambers that have a, a good amount of strength and, and experience within the Thailand and the business community. We then started working with our embassies and our ambassadors, which added a massive amount of gravitas to all of the initiatives and the conversations that we're having. We had some like-mindedness with the Japanese as well. Um, so the Japanese Chamber of Commerce, as well as the Jap Japanese ambassador and their embassy also partnered on with some of our initiatives, which hopefully some of you are aware of, which is the 10 for 10. Just which as a final word, uh, to both our members who are watching and potential members as well. How can they get more involved? Why should they join? Look, AusCham has always pr prided itself on a number of different initiatives. We're a great networking chamber. We've got the single best networking event every single month of the year. But on top of the Sundowners event, new members that aren't sure what we would be able to provide, um, it's a matter of reaching out whether it's yourself, whether it's myself, we've got an amazing board of directors, as well as past presidents and past directors that are always willing to share their time.